Hello, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today we're going to do messages from your soulmates and just going to be messages only. See what they got to say to you. So remember, this soulmate, we have more than one in our lifetime, but it could be whoever you are thinking of specifically. Could be a partner, could be a past person, could be someone you're just meeting. So let's hop into it and see what you get. And as well, remember, these are collective general messages. So please only remember to take what resonates with your story and leave the rest for someone else. And here we go. Wow, beautiful. So the first one says, you are my best friend. You're the one person I always know I can count on. So your person feels like they can always trust and count on you to have their back, to be there. For some of you, this may be someone who literally is your best friend and also someone you're interested in. Or for others of you, this is your love who is also like a best friend says i've never met anyone quite like you you're a breath of fresh air your beauty captivates me every time beautiful there are still things i'm not ready to open up about yet okay so your soulmate could be holding some stuff back specifically from you you deserve better than i'm able to give you at this moment i really am trying to get my life in order to give you the love i know you deserve it says you deserve the best so this person has a lot of admiration for you, a lot of love and respect, but they feel like they're not able to give you the commitment or the connection that you deserve right now. There's no one like you. You've changed me for the better. So really beautiful. This soulmate feels like you've inspired them to be a better version of themselves. And it's almost like they can't thank you enough for that. Okay, so for some of you, this person said things that they regret they're wishing that they could take them back now it says i'm so i'm ready to build our lives together now i'm sorry i ran in the past you are my person no one has ever made me as happy as you have let's start our own family together i'm ready now love beautiful and two more messages here there's no one else for me so sweet that's from your soulmate today and one more here says I will forever be grateful to God for gifting you to me. You're not just my partner, but you are my person. And I am so incredibly lucky. So that's really beautiful energy to be in. Your soulmate really recognizes that the connection you share is one of a kind. So for a lot of you, this is someone you're currently with or in separation from. It says, I need to get my life in order before coming forward. You deserve that. So this person definitely feels like they owe that to you and it's like they owe that to themselves to get their life in order, to get their confidence right and to get their, their self feeling good before they come forward in a position that they feel comfortable being in this long-term commitment with you. No matter how far apart we are, it says you'll always have my heart. So sweet. I feel you in my thoughts and emotions. The love I have for you is truly unconditional. So this person really has a deep love for you. And that's the one thing. It's like they could be going through some turbulence in their life. But no matter what, this is the one thing they're aware of. I feel stuck in a toxic outside relationship. It says I'm trying to sort my life out. So if you and this soulmate in particular are in separation, they've got something or someone else that's kind of impacting the relationship between the two of you it looks like they're doing their best to try and heal this other situation in order for them to come make a move towards you so we've got i can't stop thinking about you especially all the things i want to do to you so this person often daydreams or fantasizes about you and the connection and what it would be like to be with you especially if the two of you have either never been intimate or it's been a long time it's like they often fantasize do you feel the same as i do i want to grow old with you wow so this person knows that you are the person that they want to spend the rest of their days with i love you so much so sweet so it looks like for a lot of you if this soulmate and you have had a, maybe an argument or something that has put you on separate paths or pages 
just know that this person is literally longing to come back together with you. They feel stuck for some of you in a third party relationship or situation. Something that's like preventing the two of you from coming back together at this moment in time. They're saying though, it's like no matter how far apart you are, that you will always have their heart. They feel you in their thoughts and emotions and the love they have for you is truly unconditional. So that is so beautiful. Wow. So I split the deck and it says you are perfect to me and I want to kiss every part of your body. Your touch makes me tingle. So this person is so highly attracted to you. It's like not only is it a physical chemistry, but it's like an emotional chemistry. Your soulmate feels like the two of you have this great conversation and understanding of each other that only extends to the passionate side of your relationship and they are often fantasizing about showing this side of their love and affection towards you especially if the two of you are in separation or aren't in contact together this person literally longs to be in your presence again they think about it a lot and especially if they're in a third party relationship it's almost like it interferes with that connection because of how often your soulmate finds themselves thinking about you and ultimately growing their life with you. Now, the only card that kind of really stands out here, though, we've got is there are things I'm not ready to open up about yet. So this person, it's probably this toxic outside relationship or their past or what they're currently going through. That's really just like holding them back from communicating to you. And for some of you, they subconsciously said things they regret to push you away so that they didn't have to admit to the things they're not ready to open up about yet. For some of you, this could have been what they went through in the past or what they possibly put you through in the past in the relationship. Remember, these are collective generals, so it could kind of go one of two ways there. But know that regardless, your soulmate really knows that you're the one person they see themselves spending a long time with building with and so therefore they're kind of on their own journey at this moment in time focusing on getting themselves back together they could be focusing on their health right now making sure they're back in shape for others of you they've started a new job and they want to just do really well in career before they come back to you to make you this offer of long-term commitment especially if you're dealing with a masculine they want to be able to come back and provide either an engagement ring or a house, some sort of stability with the commitment. So this person wants to really be able to get that together before they come towards you. But the ultimate message here, and this of course was the final message as well, so really beautiful to come out. This person has so much love for you, so they're kind of just wanting to communicate that to you if you haven't been in contact or it's been a difficult period between the two of you that they have a lot of love for you and overall they really just want to get themselves to a place of stability in order to provide uh even reciprocity in a relationship in this connection with you so we're gonna leave that there i feel like this person really is just letting you know they feel like they need to be on a solid foundation in order to have starting or restart building this solid foundation with you but of course they want it for the long haul so something you can really look forward to is this soulmate stepping it up soon and letting you know how they feel so thank you so much for tuning in go ahead and like the video and subscribe if it resonates and until next time take care thanks for watching